Yeah, 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 this is going out to all them North and your homeboys Putting it down for they town You know what I'm saying, stop following me, show putting it down What's going on YouTube, before we go any further Make sure you do your due diligence Hit that like and subscribe button, let's go Don't be a player hater, man Mousy drop that shit, homeboy What's happening, YouTube? Another great video for you guys today, man. Actually, some news. It's some news in regard to the legend, the pioneer when it comes to Northern California hip hop, not just North Daniel rap, but rap in general. Go Toes, man. Go Toes signs a Sardanio rapper, obviously from Southern California. No Go Toes being a northerner. From Northern California, it's sending shockwaves through the community YouTube, <laughs> right? And obviously in the streets, people are talking about it because it has never been done. Northeños and Sureños getting money together, legit money, that real money, that paper. Little Grifo, I think that's his name, Some, something like that. I mean, if I'm saying it wrong, excuse me. Correct me in the comments. Uh, I believe that's how you pronounce it, Lil Grifo. He's from San Diego. A pretty popular artist down there. Well known. Uh, signs with Goto's. Now, Lil Grifo has some diss songs called No Chaps. Talking about there's no busters, this and that, 13 up, 14 down. And these songs ain't old songs, bro. The songs, I think, is barely a year old. And it's with Lil Travieso. Rest in peace, you know? So how do people feel about that? How do the Northanios feel about this? Rumors going around that actually Lil Travieso was signed with Goto's as well. How is that true or not? I don't know. But we know for sure Lil Grifo was signed to Goto's. There was rumors that, you know, uh, Lil Travieso signed with Goto's because of the, you know, I guess Goto's is fucking related to everybody, apparently. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh... I guess Lil Grifo, he went on the American Cholo podcast. Shout out American Cholo, another Sereno from, uh, you know, Southern California. He said, and American Cholo asked him about signing with Goto's. He replied that Goto's is his family. That's understandable. And again, you know, these are grown ass men. They can do what the fuck they want to do at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure they both are kind of out of that gang banging mentality and on this paper route. You you feel me? Even though Lil Grifo his his music may per you know may portray a, a certain image, I'm pretty sure his mentality has outgrown that image. You guys feel what I'm saying? And Goto's been outgrown the gang bang image, bro. If you about a dollar, Goto's will fuck with you. Period. Goto's. If anyone knows Goto's, homie, you guys know bro is about his money, regardless. You feel me? And um, then again, Goto's has diss songs, diss and Sereños too. You feel me? Northside Soldier. One of the uh, 17 Reasons. One of the biggest Northern California hip-hop albums. Starring likes of Messi Marv, San Quinn, um, all kinds of other Bay Area rappers, Mexican and black. It's a hit album. And on that album, he has a song dedicated to dissing Sereños. Called Northside Soldier. So the point I bring these two songs up, one by Grifo, which is called No Chaps, and Go Toes' Northside Soldier song, is because they both have songs in their past where they're di dissing each other's collective. You know what I'm saying? They're dissing each other's groups, I guess you should say. That one that they both belong to. Now I'm pretty sure they both know about this. I'm pretty sure Goto's knows exactly what's in Grifo's catalog. Same thing with Grifo. I'm pretty sure he researched and did his due diligence on Goto's. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure they did a background check on each other, bro. So it's nothing new. They know dude said fuck chaps. This dude knows he said fuck scraps. And you know what I'm saying? It's nothing new. It's not like they're hiding it from each other. It's strictly business. And uh, I don't see nothing wrong with it personally. If these dudes can get some money together, legit money, 
and help, you feel me, elevate one another. And nigga, why not? Get your bread. You feel me? I don't see nothing wrong with it. Uh, now, again, Go Toast has a lot of Northaniels signed to his label, his distribution label. He has a lot of Northaniels, active Northaniels, that are signed to his label. I wonder how they feel about that, how they feel about this. Because some of those Northaniels have songs that are recent that diss Sereños. And I'm not going to say no names, you know what I mean? But I'm pretty sure you guys know who I'm talking about. These dudes diss Sereños in their songs a lot. And they're signed with Gotos, who just recently signed the Sereño. So how does this work? Let me know in the comments. How do you guys feel about this? If you were one of those Northaniel rappers signed to Gotos, how would you feel about this? And if you're a Sereño... How do you feel about Lil Grifo making the decision to sign to a fairly North Daniel based label? And how come he didn't sign with the Sereno label? Let me know in the comments. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Shout out to Lil Grifo and shout out to Gotos, man. Straight up. Get that money. Fuck what the suckers say. And fuck the bullshit. Let's go.